Hello. Good evening. Don't know what that is in Spanish. That's an ambulance. Uh, down the end of the Rambler. Last Ramblas. Uh, again, having a mooch. A lot of the uh, living statues have gone. That's the, what I would call the. Uh, I was going to say Rasta alien. He's been there all the time. When, uh, to be honest, it's the same people I recognise all the time. There's a horseman over there. He's been there all day. I don't know how they do it in this heat. Obviously, they must go off for breaks. But then again, you have to get out of costume and everything. Hmm. Now, I may get run over. No, I may go... I may go to the gardens where there's street art, but I may actually leave that and do it tomorrow morning instead, actually. I'm going to go over to La Rambla del Mar, which is the walkway over the sea. It's not the spray. <laughs> it's not the same. It's, where are we? It's the Mediterranean now. Flashing green light. Oh, no hat man. Missed that one. Okay, so going over there, the other side of the, switch it around, Columbus statue. Not exactly the same as the one in Berlin. <laughs> Probably about 10 times smaller. I mean, they're, they're just gonna get run over. I mean, the traffic's crazy anyway. But... Valeria. That's a big boat. You've got the W Hotel. Are you looking at me? Look at that. W Hotel. There, Magnum. The shopping centre. And we've got the Rambler del Mar. It does rotate. It's open, it's a swing bridge. Uh, there's also, <laughs> and I've kind of said that I'd do it and I've never done it because looking at it, it looks pretty rickety, is do the cable car here. So that's over on Boston Atta Beach. It goes up to Montju, which is up there. Oh, we, I, I've said, I don't really do heights and it just looks so dated, rickety, that's the word, it is now. So, mm, can't see me doing that. However, what I am going to do on the last night I decided is, as it's nothing sparkly, but uh, as I said in Paris, I am going to go and do the magic fountain on the, I'm only lining up things to do when I leave. Um, Magic Fountain will be done at the weekend. Uh, I'm just kind of ticking off things that I can do at certain times and then, right, what else can I do? I've got, you know, I can then plan the time that I've got. Uh, I was actually going to do one of these. I've never done these. Let's just take a trip out on one of these boats. Uh, it goes out, they're very similar. It goes out around this area and back again. Well, obviously it comes back again. Um, you get 60 minutes on that one, 60 on that one, 40 on that one. It goes to the beaches. There you go. It goes all the way up to the port and then to the W Hotel and back again. Similar routes. called the W Hotel, even though it's shaped like a D. That always, that always gets me. So is it, is it the D? No, it's the W. I'm not going all the way out to Mayor Magman. I've done this several times before. Uh, there are boats parked up here, moored up. We may just go on to the Mayor. I can't even bother really doing that. You've got these people staring up at the sky. 
uh, here, you probably can't see that, on the little pontoons. And there's Christopher Columbus. No, I've got this orientation I still can't get. He's pointing the right way now. It's like that Siegesuller. So I arrived there and it was the wrong way. I had to go all the way around. Come down the Rambler again. He's pointing out to sea. I suppose he would be. He's Columbus. He wants to go out to sea. He wants to go that way. He's pointing out that. He's actually pointing at that boat. Well, then stands. see your chances then. Okay. Yeah, boat tour is going to be done. Magic fountain. Go that way actually. Start to go that way. And this is a great big massive area. If you want to get to the, and it took me a while to work this out, but if you wanted to get to the beach, last set of beach is here. There's, there's so there's about five or six different beaches that go down there. Last set of beach is the closest. You can't actually go out on this the Rambler del Mar. That's like essentially a big island. You've got to go all the way down to the end where the head is. I'll show you the head. I will go down to the head, which is a big, it's a big multicolored head. And then you turn around and then you come down. And then you walk out to the beach. Oh look, there's another one of these things as though it's 1922. Right, what can you see? Anything you want. You could use your eyes or even your phone. I suppose the magnification is maybe slightly better than a phone. Mm. I'll have to just get a boat and disappear. This this thread continues through when I kind of travel. It's like I just I think I just want to disappear. You get a boat and disappear or buy somewhere in Barcelona. So you're not really disappearing yet. You're skewing yourself to one place. Maybe I'm a bit of a nomad. I was going to go to the head. Right, I'll cut it here because this has been quite long. I'll go down to the head and uh, start it up again. Sorry, I, I, you're looking at me now, aren't you? Doggy. The head is here. It's kind of in the middle, in the middle on the traffic island. It's a kind of modern art take on a head. I don't know if it's somebody's head. I don't know who the artist is, so don't ask me. We can get close enough to it without needing to cross the main road. I think. Here it is. I'll tell you what I noticed myself doing with this GoPro footage is... I'm just trying to get one down. Um, I, when I point up, I don't point up high enough. So you can't see. See, I'm, it's probably going to go all the way up there. I don't know if that's the way the GoPro orientation works, is, but if you want to point something high up to catch something, you've really got to put it way up. And I've noticed certain things that I'm talking about are cut off because I'm only kind of doing that where well, I probably should be doing that. There's the head. Hopefully I've not cut off the top of the head. Ironically. There is a plaque. Let's go to let's go to the plaque. Love a little plaque. This is a love a little shop. Love a little plaque. It's probably going to be in Spanish, isn't it? Oh, we've got three paragraphs. One of them is in English, yes. Standing almost 50 metres high and about six metres wide. Yep, that's me. The representation of the head and the face of the city can be seen from many different places and far away. Huge brush strokes and surfaces coated with coloured spots give life to the sculpture by this American artist. The sculpture belongs to a series of smaller scale heads called brush strokes that the artist produced in his mature phase. The chromatic impact, the raised red dots, which represent the plots of printed images and the ceramic coating like a truncatus 
are a tribute to Gaudi by one of the most representative artists of pop art. Gaudi uh, is all over this city. Anyway, so this is by an American artist, Roy Lichtenstein. I thought I missed the name. There's no name in that paragraph. Is at the top. There you go. There's the head. Surrounded by concrete, but yeah. Okay. I'm going to move further, but uh, I think without this. So anyway, I'll uh, I'll sign off here. There's another. Oh, you've, have you not seen? There's the uh, lobster there on the walkway. So we just do the lobster as well. That's, that's probably got a little plaque on it as well. Mirador to Colom. That's the Columbus statue. Got to look out for bikes. Everywhere you go, there's a bike. They are taking over. Pedal power is the way forward, people. It's a car. Mm, I don't know. In cities, it's... Uh, becoming less a priority for councils. More power to the pedal. So here's the lobster. I don't know what it's made of. I don't think it's wood. Point you up so you see it. There's another accident waiting to happen. Oh, I mean, how do you do that? I mean, obviously I can ride a bike. Oh, look, we've got a little plaque. He's got a little smiley face. This sculpture of the... It's rubbed out. Valentian-born artist actually represents a prawn. It was a prawn. And was initially focused on a restaurant called the Gambrinus. When the restaurants in the Bosch uh, Alcina Wharf, then probably as a mould of the closed, including this one, the sculpture was preserved was supported in the framework of wooden beams that was the base of the roof of the building. The more than 10 metre long crustacean is suspended as if on a grill, increases its spectacular effect. Oh, I didn't know that, so it's actually been moved. It was on the kind of restaurant roof. And they relocated it here. Skater. There you are. Another skater. You could do that. I used to have some roller skates. I don't think I went that fast though. Right, anyway, signing off. See you later. More bikes.